Hi, it's Adrian. How are you doing today? So, um, I finally got a break in um, some of the holiday stuff, and so I got to go ahead and sit down and play with some makeup today. So, I thought I'd go ahead and show you what I did, and uh, we'll go ahead and get started. Um, as far as what I have on for my base today, I did go ahead and use the e.l.f. Halo Glow Liquid Filter. This one's in Fair One. And then I went ahead and used the Oma by Sharon C. Uh, this one is Fair Lady T1. And so that's what I have on there. And then as far as what I did for concealer, I used the Incognito by Wet n Wild today. And um, that's where I got to start playing with some of the newer stuff that I've gotten that I haven't been able to play with yet. The Curve Case by Made by Mitchell. And so this uh, case, it has all cream products, uh, contour, bronzer, blushes in there. I did go ahead and use this one today as far as my bronzer and my contour. And then I did go ahead and use this one right here. Um, yeah, the light pink one for the blush today. And I also mixed in a little bit of the Physician's Formula. This their Butter Glow uh, powder and this one let's see is in natural so um, I have these two on and then I did add in the Catrice the uh, Supreme Rose Beam Highlighter as well so this is everything that I have on the cheeks right now and then as far as what I did for the lips today, I went ahead and mixed uh, the Relove by Revolution. And this one is one of their baby tints. This can go on the lips and on the cheeks. And I did uh, the Fuchsia one today. And then I added in the NYX uh, Fat Oil. This one's in Supermodel. So, yeah, that's what I ended up with there. And I'm liking that combo, especially for the holidays. It gives you almost a brick red kind of color on there. And so, yeah, I thought it turned out kind of fun. And then, um, let's see, as far as what I did for the eye look, I went ahead and used the Sugar and Grunge by Blend Bunny today. Really been enjoying this one. Um, I did mostly a purple look, so I used this column right here for most of it. Um, I started with this um, actually in the inner corner. Then I went ahead and put this in the crease. I did go ahead and use this on the outer corner. I uh, put some of this right on the brow bone. And then I put this one um, on the inner corner from here to here. I did go ahead and use this peach shimmer as well, and I used it from here to here. So it's uh, my brow bone highlight right now, and um, really pretty palette. Uh, like I said, I was really excited to get it to play with the way that they go ahead and set up. They have a pastel row, a mid, a mid tone, um, a dark row, and these are all mattes, and then your shimmers are on the bottom. And I really thought that that would be fun to play with and see if it made me do my eye makeup differently or gave me, you know, some inspiration to do my look differently. And I did actually also use this, uh, the bottom purple shade, um, to go ahead and do the eyeliner as well. This is the way it worked out. And so as far as the rest of the eye, I use the Essence Wow um, Thick and Wow. This one is in Caramel Blonde. And then I used a combination of the Essence 18 Hour Wear. And um, let's see, where did it go? The Lancome Eye Doll. So I got in a, this was in one of the gift sets that I got that had the five minis uh, that you could try and so this is the Lancome and then I added some of this to go ahead and go with it for some reason this one doesn't want to close but yeah there it went okay so um, I think that's the look and how it worked out I think it turned into a really pretty purpley look 
and uh, yeah I kind of really liked putting some of the red in there it's a purple red combo and um, I'm really liking the way that it works I had actually tried it out first in the ColourPop it's a small world palette and so they have this whole corner over here of these four shades and so uh, mixing uh, this purple with the red really worked and I'm finding that I'm able to do it with the Sugar and Grinch palette as well and I kind of like the way it kind of gives you a pop that you don't necessarily get so um, different color combo but I'm kind of liking it and then I also use the Glowish and Fair as my finishing powder. So that's what I have on there. And I think that's just about the whole video. Happy holidays to you. We're just now sliding right into them. And I hope it all goes well. And uh, thank you and have a great day. I'll see you later. Bye.